Hey y'all, how's it going? Today I want to show you a new little gadget I got here from uh, it's uh, Ryobi. This is called the uh, 18 volt portable power source. So the uh, part number is P743. Looks like it uh, has the Ryobi three year warranty included with it. Anyway. Check this out. I ordered this one from the Home Depot. And, uh, this was the easiest package ever to open. As soon as I touched it, the back fell off. No, no annoying, uh, crimp, crimp, or whatever the hell you call it. Alright, so here it is. This is the Ryobi 18 volt portable power source. How's it a power source, you say? Well, you're going to hook it up to one of your batteries. Now, this is going to be great on the job site. If you don't have somewhere to plug in and you're using battery tools, now you can just hit this on your battery, right? And it comes with two USB ports on the side. On the one side, it says 5 volts, 2.1 amp. And then this says 5 volts, 1 amp. And on top here we have an on and off switch. And I was reading the uh, directions earlier. It says uh, if you're charging it's going to shut automatically shut off after eight hours. Now when you plug this one in it's over it's automatically on. Not like some of these batteries where you gotta press the button to turn them on. So this one is automatically on. Let's see, I got a battery to charge up here. It's at 87%. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. I've been wanting, wanting something like this. And, uh, I went looking for it, and it was, uh, sold out. So I, uh, Look at that, I had to turn it on. So it's making me have to be a liar, right? Earlier when I tried it, it was automatically on. Alright, so now it's on. Plugged into the 2.1 amp plug. I don't know how long that's going to take to charge. Anyway, let's see if it does anything, huh? We'll leave it plugged in for a couple minutes. See how it goes. And... We can see how the uh, on and off button works, right? Press off. See that? It actually works. Instant on. Very nice. And, you know, this big ass battery here, 3 amp hour battery, I wonder how many times it can charge up this. What is this? Uh, 5,000 milliamp hour battery. Hmm. So I don't know how that works out. Three amp hours, right? And we got five thousand milliamp hours. So what's what's more? That's a strange one because you would think uh, five thousand milliamp hours would be five amp hours, but that that's totally not the case. Totally not the case. I don't know if this battery's super dead or uh, ain't moving at all. It's blinking a lot. This is a strange one. Anyway, I'm not gonna uh, drag this on. I'm gonna come back to it. We'll come back in five minutes to see if it did, did anything. Alright, we're back. You can see the, uh, we moved up to 89% now. So it's working, you know. It's nothing, nothing to write home about. I did make a video about it though, huh? But anyway, yeah. So, like I was saying, after uh, 
after eight hours this is automatically going to shut down but that's not to protect your battery or your phone that's to protect this battery so you don't drain it past the point of no return if you know what I mean anyway if you guys want one I'll leave a link down there below maybe they have them on Amazon for you you could uh, go to homedepot.com and they'll have, they should have it like I said the item number is P743 it's just a basic charger that's it and it could save you it could save you out in the field right charge your phone up while you're eating lunch anything like that charge your tablet lots of guys are using tablets now in these in these uh, construction sites taking pictures you know there's all kinds of things you could do with this thing you can have it hooked up to your phone and just be using it the only thing I don't see on here which I would like to see is some kind of a clip I guess this is just a wire clip here you know you can stick a wire under there but other than that there's no no way to like hang it off your belt or anything like that well, I guess you could tie a lanyard around it anyway guys thanks for watching get the Ryobi portable power source just uh, another reason another way to use your batteries you know if you got a uh, Ryobi you got plenty of batteries I know I do I got at least six and various ages and they all work good still thankfully alright guys thanks for watching give us a thumbs up if you liked our video and uh, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video thanks for watching